Good evening and greetings. And for some reason, I thought I hit my mic, but I did not. Thank you for joining. <laughs> it wouldn't be me without Kevin C. here making some sort of blundering move. We seem to be taking some time to load in here. A little bit longer than normal. All right, we got the music going. We did. We now have it off. We're sitting here waiting for this to load. Janet, welcome. I want to thank everybody for being here. Will, Commander Sonak, The Rev. What is going on here? Escape? No. Hmm. That's not good. So this is my luck, just so you know. Yeah. Uh, let's get over to Discord. Hopefully. Go. I think we got Discord here. Hey, something's going on here. We're loading. Oh, there. Okay. So, worst case scenario, if it doesn't load for you. That's right under escape, right next to your one key. Mm -hmm. The title key. Worst case is you might have to tap that. It'll bring down a console. Oh, you air it out. Okay. Um, but just in case, if it doesn't happen, <laughs> if it does happen yeah. again. <laughs> if you ever have to do that again, just hit that title key and then type quit and hit enter. And it'll right. drop you out of the game. Good to know. Not being pleasant this evening. Mm. Uh, could be a mixture of things. Uh, hold on, yeah, it's lobby, something lobby. You just code. Um, so the issue that could be happening is that they might be getting ready to do server changes on Monday, so they might be messing with stuff on the back end tonight. Mm -hmm. It's not a guarantee, I doubt it, but. All right, now I have a black screen. Try it again. Well, I don't know what the hell happened. We're gonna start fresh. <laughs> it's better to do that. I know that happened right when you shut up, Janet. I don't know. <laughs> Try it again. Normally, if you get if you drop down to that console and type quit, it will drop you back out to your desktop. Alright, so do I go go into persistent universe? 
It's saying player unstowed again, but just enter anyway. It's, yeah. It's... Right, come on. There we go. At least, sort of. <laughs> Something's having issues. times me out. This isn't my fault. <laughs> no, this is a star system. I figured uh, since you had started the game a half hour ago that you might have already like reconnected. No, I was gonna wait. Wasn't sure. Fun begins. Do I time out or does Will connect? Like normally watching that loading bar, you'll see it like stutter. Um, it normally, you know, sit there on one side for a while and creep across and then stutter again. You know, it basically is loading in. And it's just playing it's just, Pong right now back yeah, and forth. Yeah, it's just zipping back and forth at the same speed. It's usually something on the other end. So it could even be that the uh, authentication hub on their end is being slammed and it won't allow you to connect to the system if it can't authenticate you. So when I'm first connecting, I'm seeing a little square pop up that's basically saying something about an authentication hub. You see it for a split second. Um, and yeah, for whatever reason, they've chosen to 
It's at the authentication hub for the entire world on one server. So anybody who's trying to connect to Star Citizen first has to connect to that server to be authenticated and then put onto the, the actual game server that they play on. It's the goofy system. Um, and yeah, so if a bunch of people are all trying to play, it'll do this. And yeah, I'm still trying to load as well. Um, the only thing you can do is try loading. Try one more time. We'll hope we'll hope the third time's a charm. authentication yeah, loading that up. black hey at least we got here now okay yeah <laughs> it's a start <laughs> all right all right cool cool yeah 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 I have a feeling it was probably just because we were in party, but now I'm bouncing back and forth again. No, no, I have no feeling. Oh, wait, no, no, wait, it's doing weird things now. That might be a good sign. Sitting at the loading screen, watching the line go back and forth. Hey, I'm in game. You're in a game? I'm in and game. You, you have been in the US, so I'll reconnect to you. That's fine. Yeah, sometimes, like I said, you have to do goofy stuff, like the point to a different. Uh, region, so again, like try to connect to Europe and then to connect, play there for a minute, and then drop back out the menu, and then try to you know, connect to the US server. Like sometimes you have to do Hey, gaming is monkey business. Mm, it's a shame when you're dealing with the alpha demo. Yeah. <laughs> Written uh, pre alpha. Damn, look at that. Holy macaroni. Spectacular. Oh, yeah. Feel free to look at the view. Yeah. What are you doing now? I can actually get my stuff started. Look at that. See, that's what I got to think about right there. Ah. Right here. Now I'm doing my city. Right, she's 
so I need to set it up block style in a way. Alright, I can sit there and look at that forever. I know, right? Hold on. Can I get down on the lower floor? Yeah, I can. By going to the elevator. The lift. The wonk -ovator. How y'all feel out there? from like spectacular to spectacular view to no view. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Is there multiple whoa, what's going on here? Is there multiple floors? Yeah, oh hey. <laughs> what's going on here? Good old NPC freaking cluster going on here. Um hey, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> this server's been running for a minute. <laughs> this whole day of streaming uh, has been fun. Um, yeah. I wanted to see, like, what were we going to do? Ship parts? Ship stuff? Or was uh, it, like, yeah. armor? Did we see armor or anything? We didn't do any shopping, did we? Um, no. We have to go to the commons in order to do some shopping. So, like, where you come in is Aspire Grand. So that's the building, like... That's uh, with all the halves in it, essentially. And then you have to take a train to get to the comments. It's got 16 more seconds. See, like, every once in a while, it's almost like, okay, that's cool. NPC just leaning and chilling. Granted, you got a doppelganger over here. So where's this taking us? This is taking us back to where all the stores were. Um, so, again, we can uh, upgrade your coolers while we're down here. And then once we go to leave the planet, uh, the space station above the planet, there's a store there that, will, that can sell you a quantum drive. Yeah, I did notice one thing, though, with the new RAM. The ride on the train's a lot smoother. Yeah, because you're able to load more, more stuff in before you get there. Whoa. <laughs> you guys know, right? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> this, this is new. Uh, what are you doing over there, man? I almost lost my headset. Wait, hey, that sounds like a GTA fix. <laughs> right on, man. I gotta run to the store real quick, guys, but I'll be back, man. I'll try to jump in and join you guys in a bit. Alright. There you go, that's fine. Are we caught in a loop? It possibly brought us right through where it was supposed to and brought us to some place that it wasn't supposed to. That's, <laughs> okay. That's why the hyperspeed. That was interesting. 
says this side goes to the comments. So we, uh, dragon, it brought us to the next one. So. You're kidding, I couldn't even get out from here though, unless there's some elevators I'm missing. Probably is. No, so this is the expo center. It's not, yeah, this is in, uh, all right, here, hit this one. One that says it's going to the comments. Uh, we just missed it. Never mind. Um, yeah, it says the comments. So, again, in the next week or so, uh, there is Citizen Con, which is like their major get together thing. And then along with that, they'll most likely do an update, or they'll have an event. And with that event, they'll have, like, you know, ship rentals, again, that you can, they're trying to sell you ships, right? So it, it's basically like an autorama car show kind of thing where you can go okay. and look over the ships and walk around them. And while you're looking at them, you can basically rent all the different ships for a test flight at a time. Yeah. Yeah. So it might go on for an entire week, but you might get this group of ships for three days and this group of ships for three days and this group of ships for three days. You know what I mean? Like as much as that doesn't break up in the week, it usually goes for most of the time. Dude, we're flying through this tunnel. Holy moly. It, it did it again. Yeah. We'll see. And it might be bugged. You might have to take an actual... Uh, I just skipped track. Hey, I'm gonna hang in with these two guys that are identical. Right. Go back in. Yeah, we'll go back in, see what happens. Because this brought us back to where we are at the Aspire Grand. That's funny. I'm gonna take the train that's supposed to go there again, the first one. If it doesn't work, come back to where we. Uh, how's that gonna work? I don't know. Um, I'm trying to think of how. Because you have to go this way in order to get to the station terminal. Interesting. If they broke this, I'm going to laugh my ass off. They'll make it an interesting night, for sure. <laughs> well, what will have to happen is you'll backspace which will uh, send you back to the space station that we have set as our main spot and we put all your arm on the left here. Which Rather isn't a big deal. Like, it, yeah, if we had to, like, you can fly here. And then, like I said, there's a, a way of going to where, we're, where I'm trying to go. Um, you can fly right outside the building and, and land and go right in a doorway and you're in where I'm trying to go, like the store. I'm at uh, New Babbage Interstellar Spaceport. Cool. Well, I would say if you're there, you can't grab your shit. That's going to be the easier solution. I think I am. Like when you get off, it's the sign where you are, right? acting a little weird. They really broke this hard. This is one of the main... So do I want the uh, Envis Terminal or the Metro Loop? I want the Terminal, right? I want the Commons. I'm gonna come to you, but it took me where I was trying to go, which is really... Yeah, when you got out, it said, you know, Spaceport on the bench, like right in front of you. Yeah. 
give me a second. One hopefully right away for me. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead in the space. Okay. Yeah, we can fly over there. I think I am. fly you back to the spaceport and you can jump in it uh, I'm almost there I think this is I don't know where I am to be honest <laughs> <laughs> you're at the spaceport like you are on that side it was the first time I've been to this city so I don't know my way around yet and this one is annoying because it is a bunch of elevators and stuff so Look like transit to an NBIS terminal. What's that? Oh, no, no. I'm just pointing out graphical stuff. Oh. Like, this looks like it should be interactive. The coffee machines are supposed to give. There you are. Oh, this way. Where are they? Uh, you can't see me, can you? Oh, there you are. I see, I see, I see. <laughs> you just popped in. Again, you always got to go through like the whole, you know, customs thing yeah. in order to get to your ship or go from your ship to the city. My goodness, where's the call pad? That's what, oh no, I didn't get up to here. Okay. Oh wow, look at that. Flight's delayed. Okay. Delayed. Where's uh oh, right here? <laughs> looking around at all this stuff. I know. I was looking at the board. It was, it's like again. Eventually, you'll be able to fly NPCs from planet to planet as like a mission kind of thing you'll pull up in a ship and you, they'll load in your ship and you fly them off to another spot and they'll get out of your ship um, but yeah there's like a board over here kind of like a flight board you know whether your plane's on time or whatnot there's a lot going on today all right man hangar five already I'm going to four I have a feeling some of the things said in the game will go with the uh, music playing in the background. What did I say was at five? Yes. Okay. I should probably. Uh, where's my nip nip? There it is. Although we did no shopping. But does that oh, matter? Okay. No, nah, it doesn't really matter. You can get the same parts in other places. It was just while we were here, you could have gotten here. So what, am I going to you, actually? What? Am I going no, to, we no? Can, we can just go up to the space station and we can get you the parts that you need from there. And then, like I said, the parts that you could have gotten here, you can get other places. It's just a matter of knowing.
shirts in Hangar 18? <laughs> That's a good question. All right. Did you get permission to leave? And oh, well, actually, I have to turn on some power first. So, do you want a quantum drive that's going to suck down fuel kind of <laughs> fast, but get you there really fast? Or do you want a quantum drive that's going to kind of sip on fuel a little bit and get you there at a moderate pace? Moderate pace. I don't want to run out of fuel fast. <laughs> awesome. My ship literally just blew up coming out of the hangar because I ran into something invisible. Oh, no way. Uh, she even will dies, but it wasn't his fault. <laughs> yeah. All right, so I'll hang tight here for a minute. I'll be a long minute because I'm going to be responding all the way back at the space station that's 42 million coins. Well, I'll, I'll, learn the, I'll try and learn the building a little bit. Um, um, what do you mean, like, learn the building? Like, like find right where the up. shops and stuff are, yeah. Oh, well, the shops are in the commons. You just got to get... Oh, but the, that... The, that the okay. train did take yeah. me there at one point, but it's... Uh, yeah, be riding in a loop for who knows how yep, long before yep, it finally yep. figures out where you're really supposed to be. Gotcha. Um, like you said, you could have flown over there, but you have to know exactly where to land. There's like no indicators. You just have to know that this spot is there's a door there. I would say fly up to the space station. Okay. Um, at, like I said, right above the city. Um, it's called Pagini Point. Stores there, and the stores there. You can sell you some stuff. Pagini Point? Yep. Or Tressler. Oh, sorry. Yeah, but Genie Point is above. Sorry, Genie Point's above Area 18. God damn it. So yeah, I want Tressler. Port <laughs> Tressler. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's Port That's Tressler. what I thought. Sorry. Okay. That's all right. I don't go over there that often, so I.
Come on. Let me know when you get landed in there. And then it's going to be like the space station above the other planet. Just go to the uh, top of the arm to land. If it has arms, yeah, I can't remember if that one's just a disc or whether it has arms. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, once you get in there, go to the gallery and up in the gallery, there'll be a store, and I'll tell you what the story is. It can't be my landing bay. Why not? I mean, maybe it is, but... <laughs> I don't want it to this be. Is another one of those cases is it's too small. <laughs> <laughs> Six million kilometers away. 
Yeah, this is not No Man's Sky. That's all I'm going to say. When you're doing this, it's a whole different thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get back, get back, get back, get back. No, 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 no. I was so good there for a minute. get used to my ship too, you know. We'll learn you. We got you. Alright, that's totally off. We got thirteen percent thrust. Nice easy landing. Try and be nice and easy. Get that landing gear out. Thank you. I will. And does that? No, it just gets me out of the seat. Okay. That's what I thought. on your way? Yeah, like I said, I'm uh, 19 million kilometers. Uh, so you're just a hop, skip, and a jump. I'm under halfway. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. And hopefully in a little bit, GT can join us. And we can get into all sorts of mischief. <laughs> I do have limited time tonight. I do have to work tomorrow, but I still got a bit more. Oh yeah. Oh. Uh, did you go up to the gallery? I'm at the. Uh, hold on. Came out of the lobby. Right, that brings me to the landing area. And med, then go over to the elevators. Like I said, it's going to be set up slightly different than the other one, but somewhat the same. We are looking for those same elevator doors. You know, the yellow ones.
tapping my foot. They're waiting for an elevator impatiently emoji. Dude, it is an elevator, train ride, simulator, like you name it, it's a simulator. There we go. Holy man. Like I said, Where are you, you gotta coming listen from? for it and yeah. you'll hear it hit, but it'll never open and then you hit the button again and then it'll open. So you just, you just gotta listen to the vision through the sound cues here and there once in a while. Right, I'm in the gallery. Alright, you're looking for a store that's going to have like a blue and white sign. It's going to be called Platinum Bay. Yep. Why do I feel like I've been here before? It looks similar to me. Yeah, everyone looks like it. Yeah. Have one. It's just different ones have different parts. So when you first come in the yeah. door on, there's on a... the right hand side, there's a terminal. That's the one you want to interact with, not the one on the left. Why? What's the difference? The one is for buying and selling commodities, not shipments. Uh, gotcha. Don't ask me why it's there. I don't know. Why they did the store it. Store is supposed to be the. Yeah, they used to both be parts terminals, and they turned the one into a commodity terminal. And like Platinum Bay is like a ship's parts like place. Like why would they be selling commodities? Whatever. Right. <laughs> So you want to look for a quantum drive, it's called a cross field. So what's it under, utility or system? Uh, it's under system, I think. Okay, what's it called again? Uh, look, at the, look at the subsystems and then look for the next drop down to be like quantum drives. Ice drive. What's that? Oh, that's ice dive. So you have the first drop down box, and then you have the second drop down box. Oh, yeah, box. yeah, 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 yeah. Between the two of them, look for quantum drives. Oh, coolers. Drive. Quantum drive. There we go. So, in the quantum drives, you're looking for one that says cross fields. Got it. Buy that. Buy. Buy. Why can't anyone put them back where they found them? It's not my job to pick up after you. <laughs> All right, what else do we want? Uh, I'm kind of looking at uh, the only place to get the coolers I normally run or are either on the planet below us where we couldn't get the store or back in Area 18. What about armor? Uh, there's no shield. For ships. What about shield? Hex, Bamodi, Armor, and Web. That's what I got. Just like, I'm just reading those, up what I got. The, yeah, those are the wrong class shields, most likely. Right. There's only certain ones you want to grab, so give me a second, I'll tell you where it will be. Gotcha. The only you place to get the shield that I run, like the best shield in the game, is Grim Hex, which you were told to go to the other night, which you haven't been to yet, but we get on as another. Oh, so we can go to, we can go to Grim Hex. Yeah, um, or Orison, which is that floating city planet that I brought you to the other day. Um, that's where you go get shields. Let me see. Oh yeah, that one, the one that was all dark. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Because my is ship is a size two? Yes. Okay. Everything on it's pretty much a size two. Okay. Um, now can I put a size zero or one on something that's a size two or is it specific to two only two? No, only like 
a size two shield will go in a size two slot. Gotcha. The only thing you can do with something like that is you can drop a size one gun someplace that there's supposed to be a size, you know, like a, a larger size gun. But how you do it is so different ships, you can put like a motorized gimbal on the front of the ship that kind of auto tracks the the enemy a little. Mm -hmm. When you do that, like say it's a number four gun, you'd have to put a number four gimbal on it, but then you'd have to drop to a number three or smaller gun. Okay. You know what I mean? Because you're, the slot is a number four slot, so you have to use a number four gimbal, but then a number four gimbal can only support the next size down. Down, okay. You, you, yeah, you I got you, I got you, yeah. So, only All right. like that. So Same we're... thing with like missiles. Um, like right now, I think you have 16 missiles. Um, you can, they're size two, I want to say. Yeah, they're size two, size three. Um, you could, if you drop them all down to size one, like you could fit like, uh, it's like 20 something missiles on your ship, you know what I mean? But they're uh, all size one. So. Right. We have more, yeah, but yeah. less damage. Right. Then there's different types of missiles. So there's missiles that are magnetic, like they're detecting the like the, the hull. There's ones that are infrared. There's ones that are you know, there's yeah. So there's there's a lot of stuff you can do. Mm. Same thing with like the guns. There's um, ballistic guns, so it's shooting an actual bullet. There's laser repeaters. There's laser cannons. There's you know. There's distortion guns, which is basically like a shotgun for your ship. Um, but the problem with those is you got to be really close in on somebody to be using them, but they will just wreck havoc on the other ship. Hmm. Um, so I normally don't change out the missiles. I leave the ones that are in there on there. Um, but I do change out the guns. Now, guns for your ship, is that under the personal weapons thing? No. No, that's somewhere else? Everything... So are you talking about buying something, or are you talking about, like, where you're looking for it? Like, when I was at the terminal buying, the, you know, uh, the quantum uh, drive. No, no, it, it would be under... It, under personal weapons, is just going to give you, like, a tractor beam and stuff like that. Oh, okay. That place. okay. It, it's a specific ship weapons store um, so the ship weapons that I normally use again can be bought at area 18 um, and then like a whole host of other places um, but that's what I use that's not what you have to particularly right. use but the drives again like I usually go with the one that hammers down on gas but you get there quicker <laughs> you know but the cross field works good okay so before you go and pull out your ship or anything like that, we need to load that engine or the your quantum drive in your ship, right? right. So hold on, I'm just walking around this place. No, you're good. That's where you want to be. You can't call up your ship. I actually have to be in storage. Yeah, it's in storage. Yep. Um, if you just hit F1. And the second tab in is vehicle loadout now. So at the top right-hand corner, you have a drop-down list. Yep, the only I ship it's going to show is your one ship. Yep. And then if you go over to, again, utilities, quantum drive, it'll show you the one that you currently have and then the one you have available. Utilities, where is that? I believe it's under utilities or systems, maybe. What are the tabs that oh, shows systems, you on the left? Yeah, there we go. Cooler yeah. 2, cold snap, cooler 1. Power plant 1, quantum drive, odyssey. Yep. So it should also be showing you a cross field there. Yep. So just select cross field and... It's equipped. Save changes and equip. Yep. Yep, there you go. All right. So you now have the better drive on your ship. Sweet. So you can pretty much leave that space station.
only two yeah, viewers. Did they crash? What happened? We had like a bunch. YouTube being funny. Show three on my end. I got two on mine. Oh, <laughs> turn myself around. For some reason, Star Citizen isn't the most popular game to be viewed. Oh, hey, Colin here. Say that. Uh, hangers. Um, I've got to get around the planet really quick, but um, I'll um, be on um, the pad. Am I going to hangers and habs? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's like you were going to your ship, and just instead I'm going to pick you up really quick. I just want to show you something down on the surface. Okay. So I'm just waiting for you to land? Yeah, I just gotta tell you what pad I gotta get. Hold on. Okay. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Please visit us again. Well, in that case, we're gonna do this for a moment. <laughs> Throw on some tunes. Hopefully. Does that work? That's why I'm on Twitch by itself tonight. Because <clears throat> you can uh, basically play real music and have it set up so it pushes the music to a separate record channel. Oh, nice. And so it doesn't come back on the video of the day and stuff. I'd love to be able to do that. Oh, nice. Do I have my helmet on? 
<laughs> Did you take it off? No, no, no. I just want to make sure. <coughs> Excuse me. We're at 25% on our leafy thing. I think we got to eat something. Oh, food? Yeah. Uh, I might be able to help you. I think I have some. Oh, you can. Just get in my ship. It's a med it's a medical ship. You can just lay on a medical bed. How'd you get the oh can I get those added? This is a different ship. It's the same ship. It's a different model. Oh. I'll take a med ship. Damn, I didn't know we had that option. <laughs> I mean I figure I'm gonna be dying almost a lot and Yeah, but they can't respawn back in the ship. Uh it's just like if you were to get hurt, you could fix yourself. Well, I'm sure I'll get hurt a lot. Yeah. So I just you hit, uh... Yeah, do I hit medical just care? Laying just laying it. Oh, just laying it? Yep, watch your gauge go back up the Oh, back. boom. Excellent. Um, if you want to come back up front, there's a seat behind me, because this is essentially your cutty black. This is what's the... This one's called the cutty red. Okay. And then, like I said, there's one... Where when you came in the back, it would be cells for capturing people. That so would be called the Cuddy Blue because it's the police version. Ah, right on. Haha, <laughs> dope. Do I get power? Uh, you can turn it on if you want, but it doesn't give you the option of really being able to do it. Again, it's not built in no, the game. It doesn't turn on my screens. Um, so eventually, and again, you, you should be able to, if not as of yet, but your job would be to like, adjust power levels and things like right. that. So I haven't shown you yet in the game, but while you're flying, while you're, you can press F5, F6, F7, and F8. And what that's going to do is adjust your power levels to different things. Um, so if you press like and hold F5, your power levels will go all to your guns. So mm -hmm. it's going to push as much power as it can to your guns. Okay. If you press F6, it's going to push as much energy as it can to your uh, shields. And then F7 would be your engine. Okay. Yeah. Oh, no, my bad. Uh, engines would be F6 and uh, shields would be F7. Right. All power to the F shields. I got and you. then pressing F8 would put it all the same level again. Um, when we get to another place, when we get your ship back, I'll show you what it's what it's doing and where you see it on your screen. Yeah, but it gives me no power option to turn on any. My screens are black. If you look around while holding it, Somewhere yeah. it says power on. Oh, there it is. There we go. But all you get so That's right, I just want the I just want the graphics. Yeah. <laughs> so you should see a screen that says power possibly and it has like a little triangle. Um like right now I just made it all go back to the center again. Yeah, I see it. Now we went to like pointing to right. Yep. Now it's pointing left. So if you, again, if you were in your own ship and you were to hit the F5, F6, F7, it would be pointing in those different directions for different things. And then if you hit F8, it would put them all back to center. Okay. So like that, now they're all back, you know, equal. All right, let me show you a little something here. Take a ground vehicle and drive in here. 
heck is this? Let's see. I'm like flying down into like this lower section of like the city. There. Is there a fire there? Yeah. Is it like a campfire? <laughs> to the window where you can't necessarily see. Yeah. A, see, I like that. That'd be dope and no man's got to be able to be co-pilot with a friend. You know what I mean? Alright, so if you jump out of that seat and step outside for a second. Hold on. Like a little hidden spot in the game. Like a little Easter egg kind of thing. That's so neat. <laughs> the Christmas presents. <laughs> That's great. Fly and doing, you know, doing it that way. Hey, don't forget to turn off your helmet light. You have to do it before you get to see. I did. Oh, it might be my ship lights are still running. Searchlight. It's not really a gun. Oh, okay. And so it's always on. <laughs> I'm like, where is that light coming from? I thought your your light from your helmet was like reflecting on my windshield. <laughs> yeah, as soon as we got in the back, I've been trying to get better at my remembering. Get mighty close there. Don't pull at me. <laughs> hey, come in. What's going on? I wonder if there's other. 
Oh, oh, oh! Don't pull at me, don't pull at me, don't pull at me. Your, ge your gear's down as well. Oh, I know. It, okay. It, uh, like I said, it makes the ship handle differently to have the gear down. Like, I'm in b tall as well. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, yeah, half that ship is gone. Wow. The whole right side. Or left side if you're facing it. But trying to maneuver, since there's no engine on one side, it'll just sit there and, like, start spinning sometimes. So I'm, like, hard uh, left strafe and also a little bit of uh, left roll in order to keep it from flopping over. Yeah. Essentially, I gotta get high enough now that I can quantum jump out of atmosphere. Space isn't as bad in atmosphere. You lose parts of the ship, yeah, and it doesn't let you fly. <laughs> Rev. I don't even know what the hell I clipped on, but I shouldn't have hit the building. I was far enough away from it. Um, but. Someone. Hey, Rebecca. Um, has a question Are there still many ships that are not implemented? Just. Did it until the hammerhead ship didn't execute? Is that something you know of? Uh, and welcome, uh, Rabbi Kai. a little hard to understand, but look, too much power. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was, that was too much power at once. Like trying to get wow, the, look at that faster. building in the middle. selection of ships you went through the list mm -hmm. the yeah oh, come on. This thing is gonna be now here. so it's easier to get into space and do what uh, it's just easier when you're losing ship parts it's easier to get it's easier to maneuver in space like, okay right now the ship is trying to fight between gravity, gravity uh, and else, you okay know? So, like, gotcha trying to maneuver is that without, real with one engine yeah it's a nightmare like i could try to technically fly over to the spaceport and repair at the spaceport but just trying to fly across the lake is probably harder than it is to try to get out in the space gotcha as much as it's right there we'll try we'll see. no 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 but... it might actually fly straighter than going up but we'll see. <laughs> This is the funnest star system. It's actually going. So I just have to watch the throttle levels. And if I go too much, it'll start to again roll. It's all weird. It's going. Too bad you couldn't land and call in an emergency repair unit. <laughs> um, so technically you could. There is a ship that is a repair ship. Um, that you can technically call in and have them repair you. Um, again, not everything on it is fully working. And, um, there's a refueler ship. That, I gotta stay on that left. Whoa! <laughs> um, that is relaxing my foot off the left pedal. Just trying to get over there. Um, yeah, that was the challenge with the mind. <laughs> Some ships is not as big of a deal because they might be a single engine. You know, oh, in center, yeah. The chance of knocking it off is pretty slim to none. Uh, you might knock off a wing or two, which again mess with uh, flight. The big thing is I knock off a bunch of my thrusters. 
So again, there is no true um, flight dynamics in this game. There's no like wing, you know, uh, like ailerons and all that. There's no true flight control. Right. It's all still through f through thrusters. So if you knock off a section of your wing and some of those thrusters are on the tip of the wing or out on the wing, well, you just lost your ability of like controlling your roll or your pitch. Right. You know, depending on where it, and what those thrusters were doing. What about turning the ship sideways and doing the sideways thrust and then just push yourself that way? Well, I mean, it's it's right now it's just unstable no matter what you do it's just a matter of slowly taking your time like i said if i increase thrust too much then it will start barrel rolling and going all over yeah technically i could drop the ship down the ground right here we could run inside because there's a door down at the lower bottom here and uh like claim the ship but we're gonna see if we can land it all right let's find out trey roth what's going on so, Rabika, uh, I don't know if that answered your question, but the Hammerhead is in the game. There's a ton of ships in the game, apparently. I'm still new to this, um, so. Capelli Bob, welcome. We got an incoming Sazable raid. Welcome, Raiders. Kiwi Pirate, what's going on? How you doing? Well, well, Will miraculously was flying like me and managed to cut half his ship ha in half. But he is managed to pilot us and limp the ship back. <laughs> I'll get off the wrong at the end. <laughs> Shocking, uh, what's going on? Alright, let's make it more dramatic. Oh, <laughs> so what's happening is yeah the bay has its own gravitational force and that's what's like throwing the ship off even more right. let's see what's hard the pedal left to do landing on the ground out here if we can all right hold on Damn. Yeah. Sazable, welcome. Thank you for the raid. Thank you for coming in, everybody. It's good to have you aboard. We're crazy right now. Half our ship is gone. Will's trying to pilot us in and get us fixed. But man, it's not easy. It's not going easy. No, if I try to go in that door right now. Oh, so finish. we're going to land? Yeah. All right, so we're just going to land. Whoa. If I can get it down the ground. Alright, we'll try creeping forward and just point it, wand darting it. The rescue ship needs rescuing. There's a ship near us that's hovering around us. You seeing that? Yeah, he's not. I don't think he really do. 
Is that another, another player? player? Yeah. Oh, I didn't do it. That was that was Will flying. <laughs> Am I getting out? train station back there, but we're going to see something really fast. Uh, someone left it running, but didn't leave the elevator down. And of course, we're in an armistice zone, so I can't shoot his damn door open either. Alice Frey, welcome. How you doing? So what are we doing? Uh, like I said, I was hoping that there's a door up here, but I can't remember where exactly it is, and it might actually be down the other direction, like where the train goes in the ground. But there's essentially another way into this building, and I can't remember where it's at. Like, you can call ground vehicles out here, you know what I mean? Um, Actually, it's on the other side of the lake where you do that. Uh, son of a bitch. My question is, why is this landing gear down? Just land. Why is it landing on top of this? And where's the person for this ship? Who knows? <laughs> I was hoping he left the elevator down. I would have stole his ship and at least used that to get into the spaceport. He's got a back seat. He could take one of us to the port. Hey, Vorpal, what's going on? What's that? Vorpal robot uh, says he's got a spare seat. He could take one of us to the spaceport. All right, oh, it's going to get like, in? yeah, the, the guy landing there. Yeah, go ahead. Let him take you. I don't know if he would or wouldn't. If he can take you up to the, if he can take you up to the space, I would take him, uh, let him take you to the space station. And then, and then you just get your ship. And then come get you? Uh, I might just do myself here. Uh, he's flying can. away, so, all right, let's go back to the ship so we don't freeze to death. Oh, he's not going to take you? No, uh, he flew off. What was he in, is he in your chat, or is he in? I have no idea. Do you hear him talking in the game? Nope. And where were you hearing that he was going to land? Oh, you? no, 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 no. Somebody, Vorpal, said, ask if the guy can give one of you a ride. He said. Oh, that, that ship is a possibility that it does or a possibility that it doesn't have. Oh, crap. Did I just really... Um... It could have a second seat. Good have a second seat. Oh, okay. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Let's see if I can't get this thing in that damn building. All right. I'm going to just stay in the bed. <laughs> the med bed so when you yeah. we crash. <laughs> no, cool. no, you can do it. You can do it. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Ooh. Yeah, I'm just gonna do what I was originally gonna try to do and get it into the space. Instead of wasting the time we wasted, I could have already been there. <laughs> <laughs> it just it doesn't like the flight dynamics in space. You, it's, it's just totally different. You know yeah, because you got no gravity. Yeah. Yep, it's just a brick. It doesn't matter what its shape is or what wings. It's just, right. When you go to do certain things, yes, you still have to have control of it, but it's not as dramatic as trying to control it on a planet surface. Right. She. I know it'd be difficult to do, blah, blah, blah. It'd be great if you could land on these different places and, you know, explore them. Some things of them would you happen. Can, you can land on, but you just, there's no. Nothing going on. Yeah. Yeah. All right, give me a moment. I'll be right back while we, we head into space. Let's wish Will all the best luck. Put some music on. starts flipping all over. <laughs> uh, yeah, flying in this game is no joke. got hammered. Oh yeah, that's the whole engine bay. Or port, whatever pod. There we go. Calibrating. Here we go. This is a good looking game though, hell yeah it is. Nice job with the space stations. Done this yet. Yeah. It's alright. 
Alright, this is where I die. No, it's not that bad. Let me get a lot closer though. It's just I don't want to be affected by the gravity on the pad and then flip around and smash, you know what I mean? So, yeah. Um, once I pull up along the pad, just go out the back or the side door on that side. Um, keep yourself like about three or four feet above the pad as you come up on the surface of the pad and then gravity is going to kick in and pull you down onto the pad you know what I mean just be a little bit above the pad there you go alright hold on yeah, this <laughs> controlling yourself in EVA is just like controlling your ship so all the same controls gotcha wow. When you first go out in space, you're gonna flip around and like go all wonky. <laughs> Just so you know. Incapacitated. Time until death. Yes, you do. <sighs> hold on, hold on. I can just. That's what I was trying to prevent. You slamming from 20 feet above the deck. Hold on. I could hold M. No, no, no. You're good. Yeah. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> Bye, ankles. <laughs> yeah. Those action pants suck. <laughs> <laughs> I need an upgrade on them action pants. Damn it. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> I can remind you. I'll see you. Save me. I'm dying over here. Nice. Thank you, sir. That gravity really sucks you down. <laughs> yes. Um, have you been incapacitated? So I'm gonna have to actually drag you all the way up to the freaking hospital. We're not into the med bay. So you usually won't fix anything above a tier three wound. Well, I could hold so M to activate the rescue beacon. That, that doesn't do anything. No. All that does is tell people that, oh, I'll pay you money if you come rescue me. That, that doesn't. Okay. And most people are going to ignore it because they don't. It's not worth the time and effort. Um, and being on this, uh, which we call the space station. They can't do anything more than what I'm doing. Right. Well, I'm not. I'm not I dead. Know, just like, you just, all, you, you are. You well, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I did it. You're but, above a tier three wound. All right, right. Okay. okay. All right. We'll see if I can slap you up. On <laughs> uh, you go back to the hospital. 
says Everest. Yep. You no, I the timer on the incapacitation. Hold on, minute something. Uh, party member Will Badger committed negligent homicide again. Press right bracket to decline. Yes, please. <laughs> I didn't kill you. You jumped in freaking. It's not letting me. It's not letting me. Regeneration. Wait, at this point you've already regenerated. All right, so it should be good. If you're okay. in a hospital bed, then you've already died and come back. Come back. All right, yeah, I got the gown on. So uh, where's my gear then? Uh, so you'll either have it there at the station or it's at this station because you died here at the station. No, well, it looks like I may have it. Most of the time you'll you'll have it. Yeah, I do. Bugs out and like it shouldn't that you do. Because you died on a space station, essentially, it'll, it'll go with you. I just have to put on my arms back in and stuff back on. New legs. You got new legs, Lieutenant Dan. <laughs> oh, forest. Homicide. He dragged me to death. <laughs> Didn't even. <laughs> Interesting. All right, so what are we doing? Uh, I am basically going over to the space station so I can call a different ship because this one will not repair properly. So when you knock off an engine like mm -hmm. that, when you go to repair, like I was saying before, um, you'll normally want to shut your engine or your whole ship down. I mean, you go do a repair because a lot of times if it's running and you repair the game just doesn't repair the engine properly it'll be there but it won't fire up okay so like right now i just got my ship to repair but then when i spun the engine to look to see whether it was like a you know like a flame coming out yeah it, it wasn't it wasn't. was basically a dead engine so right. it's just easier to claim the ship to fix it than the 
sit there and keep kicking it because there's no repairing it at that point. Right. If I were to store it like that, then it's permanent. Uh. Yeah, so you got to pay attention to something, things like that. Most of the time, the easy thing I can tell you, if your ship gets damaged immensely, it's better to just blow it up or walk away from it and claim it, you know what I'm okay. saying, and get, and get another one. Right. Then deal with any bugs that you might have that will cause you so to not work right. basically, if it's all messed up, don't store it. Just walk around if, and quit out. If you, if you hold backspace and you're not near a outpost or a space station, it will self-destruct. Oh. But normally what I would tell you to do is pull up to a space station, get out of your seat. If you're in a ship that you can get out of your seat, take off all your stuff. And without even being in the space station, as long as you're close enough to it, you'll get the inventory. And you can drag all your stuff off and put it in this space station and then fly away from the space station and just backspace the ship and blow up with it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And so you get to keep your gear, your ship gets reset essentially, you know, and uh, yeah. Welcome to the ASOS vehicle retrieval system. Um, other than that, if you want to go, I can get you to start flying towards Area 18 or wherever you want to go to buy the next set of parts. Your insurance claim has been sent. Most I, of them you can get I gotta I have to claim my ship for some reason. Did I blow it up before? Um, no, because it's still at the space station here. You're at Everest. Oh, the, yeah, the space okay. station that you docked it at last was Port Tressler. Alright, gotcha, gotcha. So you just have yeah. to claim it, they bring it there, you know. Yeah. Well, we got some time to hang out then. Well, you can hit, you can hit it. I'll get some legs. I can go, yeah, and I can get some legs too, though. Even if you expedite it, it's still gonna take like three to five minutes. Yeah. Versus the 14. Like mine was 14, I expedited it, it went down to like four or something. to wait my turn. <laughs> For, oh, the, the armor. Yeah. Which we call it? Yeah. yeah. There are players currently using it. Hopefully 
GGT will be joining us again here shortly. Back in my chat anyway. I'm gonna wait for that guy to get away away. Just in case he wants to go back. I mean, yeah, that's what I thought. Nice yeah. choice. <clears throat> I guess we're waiting a minute. It's alright, we gotta wait for our ship anyway. Backpack. Did you have a backpack? Uh, I'm not sure. I think I did at one point. Um, your accessory might have bugged back to um, Lorville. That occasionally will happen. Hey! Because I also don't have any of my weapons. should be doing then? Well, I mean, really, it's only a gun. Yeah, true. Um, you can pick it up later. Again, if you're looking to upgrade your ship, then yeah. I would uh, start heading off the Area 18. Right, 18, that's where we're going, that's right.
see if we're here there or not. Back, what I miss? Hey. Everything. Damn it! You missed <laughs> some incredible flying skills and a heroic rescue. <laughs> I, I just hear APG like, do I, do I press charges? <laughs> what happened, dude? charges on me because he died from slamming himself into a, a friggin space station pad. Up, yeah <laughs> oh man but you know how when you're eva and you come up to a, a, a landing pad it sucks you down like the gravity right he, right, he yeah. was like 20 30 feet above the pad and just was like bam like that slammed down into the pad when he went over it <laughs> yeah it's a good way to break your legs brother i found Pretty that much. out charges on me i don't know because because i was the one that dropped them off like i was this fucking uber like <laughs> I, dropped them off, I dropped them off 20 feet from the curb you know it was like him getting hit by a bus trying to make it over to the side at that point you're still responsible for it man no i take full responsibility it was my first eva though although i didn't get all flip -a which was nice i kind of went out pretty straight You'll see like the outer part that's like the gray and then the landing deck itself you don't want to go over that deck <laughs> eva because again it, there's a gravitational field around the landing pad so you got to come in low and from the side you know like three or four feet off the ground so when it sucks you down it's just a little fall it's not 30 feet above it heading for the door <laughs> I saw you, and before I could say anything, it was just like, how high is he? Oh, pfft. nope, he did. Like a bug on the windshield. What did it make you update the launcher? Yeah, it was just a launcher. The game's fixing it. I guess it's trying to load. You know how it takes a minute? Yeah, the servers are funky this evening. I think they're getting ready. Oh, that's nice. I think they're getting ready for uh, Citizen Con. When is when is that going to happen? I think it's next week. Oh, cool. A bunch of summer kids in just enjoying the game for free. Cool. And those kids are back in school. Man. I don't know if there's a free, a free fly van. It might just be a, just a regular event. You know. What was the last one they had?
event, yeah, the event. Wasn't this a military thing? Oh, uh, defense of time. Oh, so it was just um, ship week or whatever. It was just, yeah, they just showing a bunch of ships off. Oh, that's but it tight. Had different yeah. names, like it's Invictus is the name of it. I forgot but how I came like, into this one. Was it? I didn't drop down, did I? What's that? I don't remember how I came into this landing area. They didn't open the upper deck. my ship to come back which was like 10 minutes and then I just got my ship back now I'm trying to get out and I did the usual you know all Sometimes and get me out double tap it. but it did not want to let me out yeah sometimes you just have to do it twice or you know like I said have you been using like alt and then like tapping in twice or yeah. have you just been holding alt and tapping in once Sometimes twice. There we go. See, I just did that one once. Yeah, yeah who knows? Sometimes it's, it, like I said, the way, it's not that I, I have anything different than what you have going on, um, but I normally have to tap the button twice in order to make it allow me out. Gotcha. Like I normally just do like a quick double tap of the key, and then it, yeah, it lets me go. That's the next event in, in October. October 21st and 22nd. It's Citizen Con. Well, what is that? What's that? What's, what's Citizen Con? It's just a convention. Everything starts Citizen. So it's, it's not going to be like free to fly week? So they're gonna have like tutorials how to stab your friend with a med pin, you know. But they're like raise and lower your landing gear. Like I don't, I don't understand. Giving out free armor and stuff. What's they're Citizen Con, bro? Talking about the construction of the game, dude. In, in the game? It's it's, it's a, a it, it's a public funded game, dude. They have to. <laughs> show what progress they've had in the game it's, oh it's, I see. it's just a convention okay. for the game it's nothing more than them talking about the game what they've done in the game over the last year what they plan on doing with the game in the future the no right i understand that but it's just because every time they have an event it's like uh, you know they have stuff on showcase in the game you can go to a place and check things out i thought that this that's what this was no this is a real life event Yeah, I'm sitting here over here like, oh, that's cool. Another event in game. <laughs> no, it's not in game. It's, all right, it's all right. real life event. So is this going to be in the States or is it over there across the pond? Or? No, it's in Las Vegas. 
it's a different oh. place every year. All right, I'm not seeing area 18. You go to Arc Corp? Oh, Arc Corp. I don't know where I am actually. That's a good question. Where are we? So the planet you're looking for is called Arc Corp, and then the city on that planet is area 18. star map and that's where I'm at right the, now oh uh, so when you first open it it's up in your top right hand corner at like one o'clock oh my bad god damn I'm having a good night microtech five, five o'clock sorry that's where we just were was my so where do I want to be? Arc Corp. My Arc bad. Corp. The one at 5 o'clock. Lower right hand corner. My bad. There it is. I need, I need to work on those. I haven't eaten since like 8 o'clock this morning. So. You're not Ooh. yourself when you're hungry, man. Yeah, I know. No. I have a Snickers. Well, I don't have much longer anyway. I have to work tomorrow. No. <laughs> oh, okay. I started getting some ready, and now they're probably closed because it's Utah on Sunday. Is that where you are? Are you there? What? At Arcorp? Uh, Arcorp? No, I'm, I'm uh, what you call it, 14 million kilometers away from it right now. What's ramp access? That's the ramp on your ship. Really? That's 19 million something away. I'm in my ship. It's a bug from where your other ship was, or if you're seeing mine for some reason, like the, the Star Citizen. <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. It's probably supposed to be in the indicator for me or something along those lines. Where is all the icons? Alright. Where am I supposed to be? I see you. Oh, Purple was trying to friend me, I guess, too. Guessing he was in your chat. Still loading into the game here. It's just taking forever. It's been hanging. Yeah, I'm just sitting here hanging on the loading screen. And I'm not finding yeah. my destination yet. There it is.
Well, you have, you know. Go ahead. I think I'm at Art Corp, dude. That's where I'm heading. I don't know either, dude. Uh, we should still see. Do you still have the uh, invite in the, in the pending? Yeah, I can check. Excuse me. I don't want to go to work tomorrow. Neither do I. I got a week and a half left of work. Well, I go in tomorrow and then I have two days off. You get what? Oh, I'm saying I got like a week and a half left of work and then I get to walk away from my job. So oh, nice. Send a friend request to action pens. Yeah. I want to say he can't see it unless he mm. Yeah, I'm in the truth from there. Alright, I'm six million away. Yep. I'll be. I'm gonna cut my camera for a minute. Be right back. So I'm trying to figure out how to get out. Did you do the tutorial? Yeah, I did. Oh, that's why this is your main planet. Yep. Uh, we're going to be going to like the shops or where you come down out of the paths. Okay, cool. Just hang out. Trapped in the apartment complex, dude, because the floor doesn't want to rent it for me. <laughs> I'm afraid to just walk out into the void, man. Let the door close. Die. Let the apartment door close for a minute and then let it open again. Oh, I'm out in the lobby, bro. I'm sure I should have said that. I can see the entire city right in front of me with no floor or nothing. It's freaking awesome. on air, bro. Nice. I think I'm, I think I'm like in, in a corner or something because I can't move now. <laughs> I can't see anything. Oh, look, a hot dog vendor. I don't know where this is going to take me, but let's find out.
We'll find out. Hope it's not like, yeah, it did. Nice. It'd be nice to know that they fixed that instead of pulling you into the planet. Well, it you did and through. didn't. No, you'd know if it didn't, like, it used to literally feline you straight through the planet. Oh, like no. Pull you around it, you know? Gotcha. Oh, I know what you mean. Yeah, it did pull me around the planet, yes. Yeah, it'll, it'll flip you over, pull you around the planet, and, like, pull you into the atmosphere, but... No, it used to be before, if you were on the other side of the planet, you tried to do the shortest distance. <laughs> oh, okay. Straight through the middle. And just, like, plow you right into the freaking ground. It was awesome. And there was no stopping it. But it would be, like, right there, and you'd hit quantum, and it would just start, you'd be like, oh, God, no, no, no. And before you hit the cancel button, it'd slam right into the ground. Uh, but like I said, I'm sitting over the spaceport. Um, yeah, I'm... Fly down to my name. I should be able to call ATC plan. to the commercial district? No. The, where you're at is this, the store district. I think it's where we're going. Okay, cool. Sean Dothar says, wait, there's a citizen con? Thank you. 
take 10 years. Please proceed to assign landing bay. But like, if you just work around weird shit, that's like not all, it's important, but it's not important right now. Like, um, when you were EVA, they were working on changing how that works. And like, if I was going along the space station, they're gonna make it to where I can basically like not skip, but I can pull myself and just sit there and use that one pull and just like you were asking, like, well, can I hit my thrusters and then stop hitting them and I'll keep moving in a direction? It's going to mm -hmm. be like that, where I could basically be, like, floating along the surface, like Superman style, along the face of the space station, and, like, reaching down with my arms every once in a while, like, flicking myself, you know, to keep myself going. Or to redirect myself. And, yeah, they, they're working on stuff like that. It's just like... Okay, that's great, but it's not particularly demanding that, you, that I have that now, so great. Okay, looks like you're probably getting the hanger, right? Mm-hmm. It's a miracle how the most simplest thing gets drug out. Four-hour process in this game. <laughs> I mean, I'm landing. No, I'm just saying, like, oh, I just want some shields. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, it's like an entire four-hour stream just to yeah. paint some parts on your ship. <laughs> this game definitely knows how to like kill time really well. Well, that's something that No Man's Sky and this game have in common. Warning! You're blocking an active flight bed. What? Um, I broke an active flight? What? Um, it said warning something. You're blocking an active flight path? Yeah, but I... There's no other doors open. This was where I was supposed to be. Jerking that if you had to had to pee in uh, Star Citizen, it would take two hour. It would be a two hour ordeal involving tons of game mechanics. <laughs> yep. Well, first you gotta take off your helmet. Then you yeah. gotta take off your armor. Then you gotta, you gotta take off your, your suit. suit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then you gotta hook up the vacuum hose because you know 90% of the time you're out in zero G. Mm. Yeah, we do need an NMS con. I know. I haven't even shown you the ship that you're flying has a bathroom in it. Oh, no way. No, it's got a full-blown toilet, like shower stall, like all in one kind of RV looking thing here. Yeah. Most of the ships have bathrooms. Yeah, you would hope, you know. Give them a minute, they're gonna make it a mechanic where you actually have to go and like... Yeah, I saw a door with a toilet on it and looked like you could enter, but you couldn't.
Where are you, DT? He's over where we go to go to buy parts. In the court, in the courtyard. I'm tired. <laughs> You're good, bro. I'm over here, just standing here, hanging out. There you are. Okay. Last time I saw you, you got in the elevator and started shooting down <laughs> like you were going to in the hangar. <laughs> the next thing I know, you're standing next to me. I know, I'm just looking around. I see, I see it. I'm looking for the, like... Oh, yeah, like, somehow you're, you're in front of me now. Goddamn D6, sir. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. It's rubber banding all over the place. Well, i just showing him his icon is behind me in the next minute in front of me, and now he's, like, running alongside me. It's like... It's gonna be the left train. Still here. It's gonna be here for another... A Curve Plaza, A18 Central. Yep. Whoa. That was weird. Yeah, I was already on it. That was even weirder. And I'm oh, getting. It's a train inside of a train. Yeah. Pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm like, I'm getting squished. Yeah, it's supposed to be like a minute and a half apart. Not on top of each other like that. There are two trains on the same track, but they're supposed to be, you know. Yeah, there's one in front of the other. <laughs> they're supposed to be doing a loop, yeah, so they're never supposed to come in contact. Another train. Uh, I'm trapped in here. I think oh, I'm trapped in here. It's right here. It's right here. Right where I'm standing. Just come here and walk right out. You just went right by me. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> All right. Uh, so, so yeah. Yeah, definitely. Watch you guys get off the train, but I don't see either one of you. Yeah, I don't see him either. He's like I see his icon, but I don't see his character. He's six meters in front of me. I'm gonna get out in the big courtyard right now. Oh, we're here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So the first place you need to go is to this way.
straight across the bridge. Utility system, miscellaneous vehicle weapons, paints, personal weapons. Okay. Under coolers, which it's is the utility, stuff. utility okay. Okay, that's gadgets, no mining modules, no system, cooler, yeah. paint do? Did it actually work? Uh, there's no paint for that ship. They're skins. They, so long, skins. they only go to certain ships. Oh, that's kind of a bummer. Yeah. Alright. Uh, so back out? Yeah, you can get out of there and then you'll want to go into your vehicle loadout manager through F1. F1. Just like how you changed out the Plant quantum drive is our cross field. Quantum drive should be cross field. Power plant should be JS 400. Current one should be a daybreak. Okay, yeah, equipped, yeah. And the cooler was the snowpack. It should be snowpack. Cooler it'll tell two. you in the bottom, it'll say in use or not in okay. use. Okay, wait, I got uh, exclamation points on these. It's okay? Yeah. Okay. Um, and then the last thing I believe you can change is your... You did shields? No. Shields can go to FR76. We didn't do shields yet. So the quantum drive is... Yeah, we got to buy a shield, yeah, so we buy a shield yet. Okay. You should have just gotten power plant and coolers here. Yeah. Alright, yep. right, to back out. Yep. Uh, you saved the changes and all that, right? Oh, shoot. No, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> you have to go back there and do it again. There's your helmet, GT. You can see me? Yeah. I can't see either one of you. I'm standing right in front of you, like... Dead feet, like a foot in front of you. Like my nose yeah. is on your nose. I see. I'm watching your stream, dude, but I, it doesn't let me put my helmet on. Okay. Now I have shaved. Oh. All right. Now on the movie somewhere. Good. So we're leaving this door. We're done here. 
we're done here. Yeah, I was stuck in inventory. It wouldn't let me back out. Uh, so we're going back to the main courtyard that has like all the holograms oh. in it. Yeah, I'm just walking now. around for a second because this is pretty amazing over here. No, okay, I'm going to go to where you need to be. So worst case scenario, you can just track down my icon. Yeah. And GT can see my icon now, then he might see me. Yeah, it just, it just popped up, dude. Keeps acting like it wants to crash. Yeah, you're probably having to download all new textures and whatnot. Since the last time you played, it's been like a month. APG knew what that was. <laughs> um, so these two consoles right over here. Get your big ass guns here at Cinemass. <laughs> so um, there's several guns on the ship currently. You can either go in and look at your like what the ship has right now before you go in to look at like you know what you can buy um but right now i want to say it has two size threes and then it has two size three gimbals with two size gun uh, two size two guns on it i normally rip the gimbals off and just run fixed guns all right hold on so I usually run all size threes, but I will let you look and play whatever game you want to play. I just tend to get rid of the ballistics. All right, so the missile rack. What's that? Missile yeah, rack. By different missile rack. No, I'm like, looking right. at what I have currently equipped. Yeah. Equipped. You'll see like wing. Missile rack three. I have missile rack four, missile slot two, 
Missile rack six. Item port missile slot. On this ship. So it might be, yours might be down towards the bottom, because my bad. I, I forgot this. I'm in the medical one and it doesn't have missiles. I have turret weapon slot. Turret weapon so slot, turret, turret one. Turret weapons are the ones that are on the back. The, the guns that you were in when you mm -hmm. were in uh, my other ship. Yeah. Then you should have one that says like weapon right, weapon left. Yeah. Weapon right wing. Yeah. Weapon left wing. So the one that says weapon right, does it say like Vera Puck S3 gimbal mount? Yes. Okay. So again, the gimbal there, you can turn it on and off. And by default, I believe it's off. It will kind of help track your target. Okay. So it like kind of makes the gun, you know, wiggle back and forth and up and down a little bit on its own. Like you don't have to do it, it automatically tracks a little bit. Um, but again, it's a size three gimbal with a size two gun on it, right? Right. So you can either choose to put a size three gun in place of the gimbal, at which point it's fixed. Which would be the CF Panther repeater that What's I have that? here. I have a Panther repeater. Oops. So the ship should have two fixed guns on it currently. Okay. And then it should have two gimbal guns on it. Okay. Um, gimbal mount, gimbal mount, Gatling, and a repeater. Gimbal, so left gimbal mount, right gimbal mount. Yep. You don't have to left worry about the, wing the, gimbal the turret mount. so much. Right. You know, because you're not in the turret. If someone else was in your ship with you using the turret, then you might want to change them out to something else. But right now, you're just concerned with what you're using in the pilot seat, you know? Okay. So those are, again... Weapon right, weapon left, weapon left wing, weapon mm -hmm. right wing. Yes, I got all that, yeah. So, again, depending on what you want to do, whether you want them to auto move a little bit, then you'll have to be looking for two size two guns. If you want them to be fixed, so it's more like flying an old fighter where you've got to bring the fighter around to get the guns to the point where you want, you know what I mean? Then um, you can go to a size 3 gun instead of a size 2 gun. Right. I'm going to leave it the way it is for now, but... I was going to tell you, I was say, you might want to leave it and watch some videos and, you know, because again, some guns and some things are more OP than others, so... Yeah, I'll give it a, you know, I haven't even had a chance to kind of really use what's on it before it... No, you know. right now your shield's being upgraded and your engine's being upgraded and your cooler's being upgraded are the important factors. Right. So. But we still got to do the shield, don't, don't we? Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's either going to another planet or another oh, system well, altogether. We're so going to have to do that another time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, unfortunately, I have to work tomorrow in the morning. Yeah. And I know we have a... Pretty full day. And I plan on playing for a good bit longer. GT. Are you streaming? Are Either cool. one of you streaming? I'm currently on Twitch, but I'm probably going to kill that in a little bit. But okay. I was doing it to just, just to do it. Well, sorry, we didn't really get to play GT. Oh, it's all good. That's how Star Citizen goes, bro. Next time. <laughs> Dude, he's learned, like, yeah, it takes two hours just to blow your nose in the <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Uh, so my ship is stored. I can put out at this point, yeah. I believe so. Well, thank you guys. Thanks for the help. I'm starting to get it, you know. But I just don't know, you know, you know the locations and the names. And I, you know, so I'm getting a few of them. And I can travel back and forth to a few of that, thing, you know. And probably be okay. Yeah, but. like I said, you've gotten the... the just of getting your ship from here to there. Yeah. And that is the major point of this game. Other than that, it's... But I gotta do combat. Up. I gotta do some yeah. combat. And the mining yeah. thing we gotta get to as well. Yeah. Yep. And there's different ways of mining. So there's ship mining, there's little buggies that you can go mining in, there's hand mining. Um, well, awesome. Well, again, thank you all. 
I'm gonna head out of here and do my whole see you later bit. Okay, good gaming, brother. Nice stretch out. Um, and to those of you who are watching, thanks for hanging out. I do appreciate the companies and uh, hope you had fun as we totally messed up everything and the game completely threw us for a loop a bunch of times, but that was fun. Uh, <laughs> it's pretty much that's how it goes almost every time. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what time I'm getting out of work tomorrow, so who knows about that, but Tuesday morning... And who knows with the No Man's Sky updates coming and what's going on with that, but we'll probably start on the PlayStation because uh, we're going to have to disable our mods on the PC for all that. And uh, so we'll see you at least more than likely Tuesday morning at 10 in the morning in the Eastern Standard Time in the U.S. So until then, this has been me, Kevin C., here at Extra Pants Gaming, wishing all of you citizens out there, excuse me, a little love, peace, and starship grease. Take care, y'all.